Hello guys, welcome to Filament Daily. Today I want to show you two examples of repeater field in the edit form. This example comes from our course on Laravel Daily about creating filament CRM and I will link that in the description below. But in this case we're talking about repeaters where you can add documents and additional custom fields to customers. In the model, in the eloquent side, in the customer you have documents has many and custom fields has many. But this is a bit different because custom fields are actually many-to-many -many relationship. But repeater field requires you to have has many to the pivot table, which is exactly this custom field customer is a pivot model. Whereas for documents, it's a simple has many relationship. And now in the form of filament in the resource, you can do something like this. So add a document which has a form with as many fields as you want. In this case, it's file upload and a comment. So I upload a file, a screenshot and some comment, and then I can add one more document or delete. And similarly, in additional fields, I can add another field. But in this case, as I said, it's a bit more complicated. I need to choose field type, like for example, company name and put in Microsoft, for example, or whatever is the company, then add another field and stuff like that. And then we save changes. And in the database, they are saved in the documents table like this one, for example, and also in the pivot table of custom field customer with value of Microsoft. Now, in the code of filament resource, it looks like this. Actually, let's scroll a bit up. So here's the first repeater, repeater make documents with relationship of documents, which is the method of has many relationship. Then this is interesting on top, visible on only in the edit form because it makes sense to upload documents only if the customer is already created. Then also we specify that as not reorderable. So there is no way to change the order of the documents and provide the schema. The schema logic and syntax is the same as in any other form. With custom fields, as I said, it's a bit more complicated, but just in terms of select field, this one. But the logic is the same. Repeater make, relationship name, schema of form, and that's it. So these are just two examples of a repeater field, which should be used if you want to add multiple additional data to the main model managed by your filament resource. Actually, repeater has many more features and examples. So I advise you to read the docs about that repeater field in full, and I will link them in the description below as well. That's it for this time and see you guys in other videos.